Hi guys, welcome back to the channel and the subscribers. Uh, this is a short video today, just a little walk around a bit of a historical place uh, called Radford Lake. Um, there was a 13th century manor house with 50 bedrooms uh, in this area, which is now no longer there. It was acquired by local authority and there was a council estate or private housing estate built on it. So uh, the 13th century house was remodernized in around about the uh, 17th, 18th century. Um, and uh, unfortunately caught fire and was damaged and left in ruin for several, several years and eventually um, torn down. So we're at um, Radford Lake now and we're gonna take a walk around look at some interesting history features of buildings and stuff in an old folly which was a castle with a gatehouse which you would have to cross to go into the land of Radford House and get permission so you had a gatekeeper there so we'll go down and have a look at that and uh, enjoy so uh, catch you in a minute so this is a stream that ran down past Radford House and down into the man-made boating lake which then ran into Hoo Lake. So we'll see the Bolton Lake, and there's, uh, the Bolton Lake was dammed in the 19th century. The lake was created in the 19th century. It was dammed, and uh, we'll go down and check it out. We'll have a look at it in a minute. So we'll trek our way down. Yeah, this place is also a legend to a haunting. Um, a white lady is supposed to be seen around here in these woods. If you check it out on Google, Radford House, Radford Lake, you'll find that. Yeah, it's a great park to walk around this. Um, get a lot of people use it, walking their kids and dogs. Again, it's, it's in the middle of the town and the city, so this is part of the lake here. But we'll check out some of the bits. So there's a picture of the house. It's not the best picture. I can't get focus on it. It's in behind glass, but that's Radford House there. And that's the legendary story of the white lady ghost the white lady of radford so it's a bit of a legend and uh if i can get in on that you could probably pause it and read it so yeah we're coming up onto some buildings and structures Cold day today, folks. So this is an old house, just on the lakeside. And there's a date on the fireplace in this house. That's a crazy place. That's crazy. was a date on it somewhere can't remember where it is now but look at that for an old fireplace in the chimney going up scanning around All the birds over there flying through. Doves, ducks. Crazy. Got some more structures here. 
window with some sort of a I wouldn't say that was a seat of any sort but it's a very little place got an old window there down through the archway I'll just get a bit of scope of the building from the other side check out these doves like look at this there's loads of them flying around so we're just panning around sorry about panning around quick that's that little building now there's one in behind it now that is an old mill furnace thing where they you know what I mean do the mill the mill things so we'll have a look at that. And this is an archway on this side of the lake. And obviously you've got the wheel thing there. I don't know, making bread or something, I don't know. Gonna have to do a bit of research. Terrible when it comes to things like that. We've got Callum climbing over the wall there. I don't know what the hell he's doing. We've got an old slipway here, oh, an old slipway with an arch, probably had a wooden roof on this. We'll pop around and have a look at the mill bit. So this is an old mill bit we're going to check out. To the office, nothing in there, it's a dead end. Obviously, that's where they used to burn and st stuff. Kiln. Yeah, kiln, that's it. I'm trying that? to think what it was. It's a kiln. mad I like that there's another entrance right here and that's gated off as well as you can see but like I say there's nothing in there it's just a small room so what we do is we'll carry on down and check out this other place the castle there's that house again So there's a view of the lake with the birds castle at the other end. So we're walking down to that now, so we'll check it out in a minute. So yeah, we're still trekking down this side. So we're still within the estate of the house. And obviously we're walking beside the man-made lake. That was flooded, dug out and flooded. An old boundary wall here. Bit of an old boundary wall. And we'll head on head on down. So this is another old part of an entrance way to the estate again. Coming up at. Obviously now the land has changed around it. And that now just goes up and into a huge quarry. So there is the castle in the distance there through the trees. So we're going to have a look at that now. So there's the old quarry in there. And there's some old quarry buildings around here. It's all gated off though. Some old quarry buildings and slabs, but uh, there's people in there though. So we'll go just go over and quickly check out some old shipwrecks. <laughs> one over there. 
there's one there in the mud. Obviously the tide's out at the moment. See if I can scroll in on it. There you go, it's an old boat there. And there's some old boats over there. Where's the castle? Coming up on it, there's a couple of people around watching birds. So let's get a little bit closer. There's the lake. And the castle. So we had a bit of a dining room downstairs and a kitchen. Two rooms upstairs with a spiral staircase. Don't know what that is. Possibly a well, I would say. But yeah, this place is pretty sealed up, so there's no getting in here. There's the turret. Well, it's a cool building. Obviously, that was one of the doorways. Yeah, yeah, there's no getting in there. I reckon that was a well, Callum. Let's just check out the other side. There it is in all its glory. And uh, this is the man-made dam here that keeps the lake back. Like I say, the tide's out at the moment, guys. But yeah, that's crazy, that. Let's just trek back up and have a look. Yeah, it's a shame you can't get in it, but not to worry. This is like a little... Something. Yeah, that's cool, that, I like that. So we're going to take a walk around the path now and uh, find some caves, apparently. So stay with us and we'll have a look. So yeah, that's the pathway through to the arch and the castle into the estate which then goes all the way around the lake to the other side up there and the house is up that way, well it would have been up that way if it was still there so there's some old boats here guys so I will be running out of battery and I'll show you a quick picture of the caves in a bit yeah some old boats there in the lakeside so catch you in a minute right guys I'm just going to quickly show you the entrance to some caves before my battery dies on me and this is a cave entrance guys it's padlocked but it takes you down into some caves under this huge hill so uh, thanks for watching guys and I'll, uh, I shall catch you on the next one. See you later.